My name is Shahida Sinclair, I'm 22 and I'm an artist and musician. I'm part of a collective and art gallery called Where People Sleep and I'm also a musician and DJ and rapper under the name of Nova Scotia The Truth. Where People Sleep started in August 2016. We first started doing exhibitions that would lead on to an after party with our friends, our DJs. I moved to Glasgow to go to university and ended up dropping out within a few months and one of my new flatmates, Samantha, had not gone to the art school that she desired. And the third member, Amy, she was part of art school but she was trying to find a way to create opportunities for herself out with that. So we began hosting exhibitions in the flat. Since then we've hosted over 12 events. Having Where People Sleep, our gallery, has been important to us, like the three of us in all different ways. For me it's been a, a kind of stable, constant thing, like a consistency in my life at times where other things have been like a bit crazy or like I've had loads of different things going on and it's just been like something that I can rely on that I know is going to be there. I've always been interested in music from a young age. Um, I started sort of listening to sort of more independent stuff that was less like commercial. A friend, old friend of mine downloaded this music production software called Fruity Loots onto my laptop and it took me a good few months to actually be able to make something substantial on it but the first time I exported a track and uploaded it, it gave me a really great feeling. I started to realise that you know it was actually possible that I was going to be able to make my own music. Amy and I began to practice at home a lot and learn more about how it all worked and now we've DJed on radio and start DJing at the Where People Sleep events as well. The Vag Power Collective uh, booked me for a few show, and that was really great because, you know, it's like just took a couple of people to believe in me to actually get things going and actually start things happening. Calm Down Dear was an exhibition curated by Lucy Lamore, who is an artist and student of Glasgow School of Art. It was sort of based around the, yeah, the female experience, female identifying experience, and the frustrations that can come with this, but it was also very broad. The curator was sort of looking at it from a Weinstein sort of angle, the sort of you know, terrible treatment of women that is coming out and being exposed in the media today. It was an open call, so that meant that anyone that was female identifying or non-binary could submit work to be shown. And we had over 20 artists, and it was a really great night. It was um, full of performances, really great performances, and even I didn't know what to expect. We've got our next fundraiser coming up in April. We're really excited for that. And an exhibition in Edinburgh, which will be the first time that we've done that. So we're really just looking to hold more events, more exhibitions, more interesting venues, and just sort of reaching out more to the community. We all like to stay busy and keep moving. Like I definitely get restless quite easily. 
and when you constantly have something on the horizon, like it's something to work on and and then like something to look forward to as well. But um, there's always something in the present too that we can just be celebrating. So it's a really nice thing to have. Level 2